Yo, greetings for one and all. Little Minty there. And you know, every now and then I like to hold a little reasoning with the artists from um, near far. Tell you what's going on in and around the musical world. But um, I tell you what, today we've got an artist. You know what, I've known him for a little while. And it's always the case. Those who's always around you and so forth, you just never get around to hold a, a little reasoning with him. But um, he's been doing his thing a little while. Got a few albums on his belt. Holy platoons out of the world. But um, you know what? Let's bring him in and find out the journey. Solo. Greetings, King. Bless you, love. Bless you, bless you. Good to see you, man. Good to see you, Good to be here. All right, all right. This is for my Rasta as. <laughs> yeah, man, Rastas are not in pastas. So that was a chemist. For real. <laughs> yeah, how we go? Walk like Rasta, talk like Rasta Not a feed them head and let them preach about gangsta Blaze a fire upon that star, men a rating pasta Never read about money, not the fat and not camera Walk like Rasta, talk like Rasta Listen to them words of slugness in my heart Blaze a fire upon that star, men a rating pasta Chancellor see I left this nothing to shower I would never get them teachings from them of Rasta and gangsta in the same sentence, boy, you're wrong. Rearrange your conversation, you can't fix gun man. With Selassie, I saw them confused to life in front of them, and them don't know which they choose. Uh. In a them art, them know it, Rasta, them can't lose. But bling an art to art to right now, I catch the views, and then up the limelight of the news. Uh. Walk like Rasta, talk like Rasta. Not a fit them head and let them preach about gangsta. Blaze a fire upon that star, venerating pasta. Never read about one in a defect and a camera. So, Solar Banton, for all the viewers who do not know Solar Banton, his journey and so forth, tell them a bit about where's the journey for Solo. Where did, where did it all start from? Well, I've always been into music, you know, into the sound system thing. So, mm. I was, I, was um, I grew up in West London, Shepherd's Bush, you know what mm. I mean? And, um, <clears throat> yeah, I was on, on sound system holding a mic on there. I used to be on a sound from Acton called Majestic. Back okay, in the okay, days, okay, you know okay. what I mean? I used to do like a like a freelance work with Funkers Delight and them kind of yeah, sound yeah, yeah. back in the day, oh, you know yeah. what I mean? And then um and then I, I moved to Reading. Um in my early twenties I, I moved to Reading mm -hmm. and I was in a in a sound called Classic One. Now Mr. Solo Banta introduce yourself to all of the muscles. Don't check. Don't check. Don't check. Don't check. Don't check. Now Mr. Engineer I'm begging you know, kiss up the microphone, kiss up the sound, everything currently nice. You see me? The sounds in the classic 90s, one down to Reddit Town passing through. We call this one the first round, you know. And we have blessed up all clean, haunted people in other places. Now watch how we move now. What do you say? The sounds in the 90s, one the sound we come on. All clean, haunted people. I say. I've got to get myself. It's still going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're still, they're still, still playing now, you know? Still playing okay. now. So, yeah, I was doing that. Um, but when it comes to, like, lyrics and singing, from those early, day, early days, uh, like I was saying, with, with, with Majestic and, and them thing there, mm -hmm. I used to be on the sound and DJing and stuff. But I was never really... Interested so, in being like a recording artist. So you, so you were just like an MC. You wasn't, you wasn't MC. a selector or nothing. Like. Oh no, I used to select. I used to play yeah. the soul music, you know. Oh, okay. Oh, so soul. I to, yeah, I used yeah. to play. I okay. used to play like like rare groove and yeah, thing, you know? soul led and everything. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. He's a music addict, you know. You know what I mean? So yeah, yeah, yeah. I play like the rare groove and lovers rock of them because mm. that is what I do. And, and differently from that, I'll be on the mic, you know, MC and that. But well, I was always happy in just um, MC on the sound. Mm -hmm. I was never really interested in 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 being a recording artist, you know. Okay, and okay. Like I said, when I was in Reading, I started producing. Started producing stuff, and I was writing songs for some other artists, okay. writing lyrics for them to record, and, and I was yeah. really producing them. Really. Oh, so it's produced. Well, that I didn't even know. Yeah, yes, sir. yes, good. Okay, so you so you you're producing first, so 
Yeah. Okay, okay. So what, what, what kind of... So do you get somebody to lay down a rhythm for you and all, and all that stuff? I was making the rhythms, I was, I was building the rhythms at home. Mm -hmm. On my keyboard, Cubase or whatever like that. And once I had found a rhythm that I really liked, I would then take it to somebody to um to do over properly. Like I'll take it to Mafia and Floxy. Yeah, yeah. I don't want, I don't I had a couple of rhythms that I've done that I've got Mafia and Floxy to play over for me, you know. I mean I put one of them out on seven actually, I had like a Anthony B and a singing melody on it and stuff mm -hmm. like that, you know what oh, I mean? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. But so yeah, I'd, I'd I'd always just make the rhythms at home and then take them and then once I was once I was a rhythm that I really liked. Mm -hmm. I would then go to the studio and really get in the studio so and take it to that level, you know what I mean? Okay, okay. Do you have your own label in there? Yeah, 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 I had a label called Tiger Man Records. Tiger Man? Yeah, okay, Tiger okay. Man Records, yeah. Well, I bet if you even you go to my connection, oh, I must have one or two. You in might find still. one still, yeah. Okay, you okay, might okay. find one still. Alright, so from, from that, and that, then they used to still in Reading and used on Classic yeah. One or something? Yeah. Alright, so where did it manifest from there then? Well, so I was I was producing at the time. I, I was I was producing one rhythm at the time, and I asked um, <clears throat> uh, this guy. I was introduced to this guy called Chris Chemis, mm. who was a producer as well. He played a bit of guitar, and I asked him to come and play some guitar in the rhythm. So he come down to a, to a studio where we was um, to play the guitar in the rhythm. Mm -hmm. And then while we was having a little break, I just went to the mic, you know, I started chatting some old lyrics from back in the days, like you know what I mean. And when I come, just just vibes in, you know what I mean. And when mm -hmm. I come out. He was like, yo, I want to produce you, you know, come to my studio, I need you to do a tune and rare, rare. <laughs> so, like, I come to the studio, but yeah. I don't know about doing a tune or nothing like that, you know. So, mm -hmm. I used to go around there, we used to build some rhythms and just vibes, really, you know what I mean? And it just, mm -hmm. just kind of grew from there, you know. We were making a little, one day, if you want the full history, we were we doing a little, he started to do a video while we was freestyling. Mm -hmm. Me, Mikey Murica, and uh, Marga, and Deadly Hunter. Mm -hmm. And we were just vibing, you know, and they started to film it, we were just chatting lyrics and that. And uh, a record label in Germany saw it, it was friends with Chris. Mm -hmm. And they was like, yo, we have a rhythm and we want solo to do it. And they pestered me for about two months because I wasn't interested in doing it, you know. Yeah, yeah, okay. And he was like, <laughs> and he kept on with a solo, the man I want you to do this to you. And I'm like, that's not me. I'm a producer, I write lyrics for people, rare, rare. Mm -hmm. He's like, just do it, just do it. So I'd done it, I, re I recorded it and he sent it to them. And they loved it and they released it. They put it out in 7 inch vinyl, right man. And I was a set like, I think they sold like a thousand coffees in like two and a half weeks or something. Okay. Like that. So that, that was your first thing out yeah, there? Yeah, 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 properly. Okay. Like, you so know what I mean? Chris yeah. Gemis, that's reality shop. That's yeah. reality shop. Right. Yeah, he had his own label already? Yeah, he already had his label. He mm. was, he'd already put out a couple of releases. I think he put out two releases when I met up with him. Yeah. So, you know what I mean? So he was already doing his thing at mm. the time, you know? Where was he based in Reading? He's in Reading, yeah. Okay, okay. Reading, yeah. Yeah, so he, he already had his thing on, but um, but yeah, I, I went and checked him, uh, I was there for, uh, <clears throat> we just got on very well, you know, mm -hmm. and it, it was a nice camp at the time, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's a lot of artists around him at the time, you know what I mean, and um, it was just a nice camp, nice vibes, you know what I mean, so yeah, just, okay, just okay. There, still, you know? okay, and so, um, obviously that was the first one, and then it just led on to the next one, and yeah. next one, next one, so we'd I'd done that first one, like I said, I wasn't really too, you know what I mean, I'd done mm -hmm. it, and then they, they sent it back and um and they're like, yeah, they're putting it out. Chris said to me, oh, they're going to put it out. You know, I said, for really? For real, like? Yeah, and they're like, yeah, they put it out. Mm. And it and it um it went. It went and I couldn't believe it still, you know. And mm. I went away, I think I went away with Deadly, with Deadly Hunter. Mm. And we went somewhere and um he'd, he'd come off stage or whatever like that. <clears throat> and we were just chilling and they had a sound in the, in the, in the tent over there. And I hear this, I hear this tube playing and I said, yo. I think that's my tune, you know? Mm. And we run over there and the tune was, it was mashing up the plates, like they pull it up like three times mm. and stuff like that. So yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. And then from there, yeah, we just carried on doing some okay. things really, you know? Because uh, although, um, cause you're, uh, well, I know you're a busy person, although you're recording, because you record quite, quite a few um, um, record labels and so forth, yes, producers and so yes, forth. And um, obviously you travel wholly. I don't know where you haven't been. I know you probably <laughs> toured the whole of Europe. So yeah, far. yeah, yeah. I, I would say I've touched most, most places mm. in Europe and, and worldwide. It's been good still. We we'll come to share the bands. We we'll come to write the rounds. Now we we'll come to tell the truth. I met the world more. The king is majesty. Rasta far right teachers Tell some people for look up on him speeches Cause enough of them I call up his name Like it is a game and the people mislead it Say from you a heal his majesty Make sure you not speak no blasphemy Cause we don't want a boy you a choke I make the wrong coat and create a travesty Rasta far right said I'm a 
say that black and white as forms of speech and as a means of judging mankind should be eliminated from human society. Rastafari said, human beings are precisely the same, whatever color, race, creed, or national origins they may be. Rastafari said, when the will and determination exists, nations and peoples of diverse backgrounds can and will work together in unity for the achievement of common goals. Rastafari said, no one should question the faith of others, for no human being can judge the ways of God. Do you know the spirits of the man you're calling? Do you know the powers of the name you're chanting? Of them, claim said and know the king, and never listen to his reasoning. What's the main, I know, I know, you 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 more li- you like the 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 old dance or kind of stuff, but um, and it's you know like a, a root to reggae like you know. But what's what's the main um I should say kind of rhythms anything that 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 you can feel you just say yeah yeah it's, it's, yeah it's just what I'm feeling really you know and and, mm. and if I know the people them like the like the connection I like to have a connection still yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean and, and um. Yeah, it, it, I, I just love music really and I love the creativity really, so mm. I, I don't mind, you know what I mean? I really don't mind, as long as, I'm, as, long as I catch a vibe with it, then it's good, you know? Mm-hmm. It's been good doing doing this album because it, it's gone back to doing the the music that comes from here really, you know what I mean? So I, I, I'm more reggae, one drop, okay, and, uh, okay. muffin style really, but like, but yeah, I don't mind any, anything. Oh, oh, over the years I've had slides off from dubstep things. Yeah, yeah, because, 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 because like over the years, I mean, you know what I mean, when I was um, present on Ben TV, yes, sir. I was doing that music corner show, and a couple of your videos I've been featuring, because yes, um, I like the reggae recipe, because yes, that, that was kind of funny, and it, yes, it, it, it was good as well. Yes, yeah, 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 because it's, it's got the message in it, you yes, know what I mean? Um, with the top chef, you know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> in, in, in the kitchen, yeah, 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 yeah. You need to see that video, reggae recipe. Reggae yeah. recipe, yeah. yeah. Go on YouTube and see it. Come me come to tell you about the sound that lead the way Them the sound they play in night and day Australia and Asia, Africa and Europe Canada, South America and the USA In a the great breaking recipe Come let me tell you about the great breaking recipe Some bring 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 great breaking recipe what? Let me tell you about the great breaking recipe Say if you want the people bigger dance and gather wrong then you know you got to play the every weird song What a natural mystique when reggae music touch down If your aunt did ever last, then all this can be found Set up a pound of jump and set the foundation Are you read the mouth it off me, say you read the mouth it stronger Five ounces of bass, let me shake up the place Like a bird to a feather, them can't separate See the bass it time for play When reggae music, then your bass it time for play what? And then you jump for the guitar, then you jump for the keys uh. Strum too hard and then you drop them off beat Some call it the chop and some call it the skunk Some call it the cut, some even say the chicken scratch Reggae music meant not Anytime you hear the sound of reggae influence start Lord, now a pinch of rock steady and a bubble of gun uh. Stirring some love and bile with some passion uh. Leave the simmer down and then you add percussion Get the drum the heartbeat of the nation He not the great reggae recipe Also, there's the um the other video where um I used to play as well It's like a ska The, the make your groove Make your groove, yes, yes, yes So every day and like, come like the blues brothers, you know, you know yeah, yeah, yeah. But then that one there, if, if I could tell you, that one it took me by surprise, you know mm. <clears throat> Because at the time, um I done a I done a, a a few tunes with with these um, German labels, and they was doing real, real old school digital, mm. like like some really like, you know, it sounded like when I first heard it. If I'm honest with you, when I first heard it, I was like, what's this? Mm. I was making the rhythms there in my bedroom when I was at school. Like mm. I was thinking that they hadn't progressed mm. anywhere. But what it was is um, they were just they just loved that era. Yeah. So they was fully livicated to that era. So it wasn't that they hadn't progressed, they just loved that yeah. era, if you understand what I mean. And so I done a couple of tunes with them, but um on, on that style there and they were big tunes. Mm. Like I done um like Music Addict and, and some other tunes like that, you know. And they were big tunes in Europe, like they was on 
there was a national player on on France's um, biggest station, like Radio One, oh, okay, and that was on, nice. that was being played every day. And so, what I would find to get back to the story is that um, anytime somebody um, linked me to mm. do a tune, mm. they were trying to replicate this style yeah, yeah, yeah. and send me these kind of these kind of rhythms. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So these man from Italy linked me and said, yeah, they want me to oh, do a tune with me and this and that, you know. And I said, well, send me the rhythm and let me hear the rhythm. Mm -hmm. And I said, let me go from there because I got to feel the rhythm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so I was expecting a copycat, this kind of digital style kind of thing, you know. I downloaded it, I pressed play, and then ching, 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 I'm kind of scarting. And I was just mm -hmm. like, what? I was not expecting yeah. that at all. So I was straight, I was like, yeah, I'll do it. It's kind of something fresh and something mm -hmm. different, you know what I mean? And then they flew me out to Italy to do the video and stuff like that. Yeah, it's really good. It's no. a good video still. No, no, I'm like, really like, like it. And, it, and it's bubbly, it's bubbly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good so people. It's proper vibrant, you know? Yeah, mm -hmm. and a lot of work with them people. They tour across Italy with them yeah. and stuff. Yeah, good people. Good oh, yeah, nice, nice, nice. I got the group to make your move. Couldn't never lose hope. Everybody was a fool. I got the track to make your rock. It didn't spot that you know with us now, so. I got the group to make your move. Couldn't never lose hope. Everybody must have fooled. Now hear me a chat. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's all we lost. I'm come again with another anthem. Look on up for them. I think another mind how to manage it every time. So when I stop shine, just show me the signs. I was spin, we have spin like a turbine. Fast like a skyline. Oh Ferrari, we got me crew from the Tari. Off the Anja army. Now forget the cast in reality shocking. I'll be blocking the fans and coming like a fugitive. I just keep on running. Hops keep on jump on the digital rhythm. No schism, bond racism, bond demonism. Lyrics on me on a minute, do we play the rhythm? I got the groove to make you move, couldn't ever lose hope. Everybody must approve. I got the track to make you rock it in the spot, and you know with us now stop. I got the groove to make you move, couldn't ever lose hope. Everybody must approve. I got the track to make you rock. So you gone three albums? How many albums you got at the moment? Yeah, the the new album will make the third one. That's the so third the first one is was Walk Like Rasta. Walk Like Rasta, yeah, that, that's the one I remember. Walk yes, Like Rasta, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, and um. And that was that for Reality Shock? That was on Reality Shock, yeah. But they've all been, they've all been on Reality Shock. So oh, they've all, all been the albums. Yeah. I've done a couple EPs mm -hmm. that was on different labels. But all of the albums have been on Reality Shock. So. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Nice, nice. So, yes, so yeah, it's, that's like the in-house. That's, that's like um, home, the really. That's home. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah, home. Yeah. It's home in that way there. So um, mm. even though we're glad to work with everybody and, and anybody on work mm. anywhere too, um, like it's, it's, a it's home. So when you yeah. when you're coming to do a project, mm. when you're saying yeah, you're gonna do an album, I, I need to be comfortable. So yeah, it's yeah. at home. So even on them first two albums, mm. so I know what like Russell on the higher levels, which is the second album, there was rhythms on there from other producers mm. still. But whatever what what we done was instead of um just taking the tracks and making a compilation, yeah, the tracks the tracks that we chose, I revoiced them okay. at Reality Shock. Yeah, yeah, just to try and keep that. Continuity the same, the same for the album, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Okay, I, mean okay. I like the way Chris mix, mixes my vocals as well. Mm. I think mm. he, he mixes my vocals the best out of anyone I've worked with. So, yeah, we, we say, all right, we do take this one, this one, this one, and, and I just revoiced all of them mm -hmm. again in, in, in a reality shock and he mixed them mm. and stuff like that. Okay, you know I mean? all right. We'll soon come on to the new thing. Yes, sir. But, um, the last thing I did get from you, a few, about three, four months now. Yourself and Maccabee. Yes, sir. Um, edutainment. Yes, sir. I'm going to see the video for that. You need to check out the video for that because I, there's a proper message in that video. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm going to like how the, 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 the whole concept with the library and all these things yes, and, and you're giving the, the, the use of the book and all that. Yeah. Like, you know, education is the key. Knowledge is the key. Do you know what I mean? Definitely. So, um, edutainment, you need to check it out. So, how, how did that collaboration come, come, come across? Well, um, I met Macca a couple of times. <clears throat> And um, we obviously I knew of Maka, but he, he knew of me. He done he done some he done a couple of tunes with Reality Shock, and um, he knew Deadly Hunter as well. Uh, and everybody knows Deadly is my my brother from another mother. So um, I met Maka a, a, a few times and stuff like that, and just got to know each other. And, and then I can't remember, I think Chris made a suggestion or somebody made a suggestion and said, "Oh, it'd be good if you two done a tune together," you know. Mm. And we both looked at each other. I was like. Yeah, that could be all right, still, you know. <laughs> and then, <clears throat> and then, um, it was never really mentioned again. And then, when mm. we said we was gonna do this, do this album, you know, mm. do this album, Chris was like, you know what? Now we should do that Maca combination. Now, exactly, you know yeah. what I mean? 
So I link him and ask him, and he was like, yeah, 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 he, he'd do it. He said, that's, when you get the rhythm and the idea, just let me hear it, and we see if we can go from there. Mm. And so, yeah, that's the basic, that's, that's just what we've done. It took a little while to find a rhythm, though. Mm. I wanted it to be a good rhythm, you know what I mean? And then um, from there, we just set, set in the rhythm, I recorded a little chorus, of an idea of a chorus, mm. and sent it to him. And he was like, yeah, he like it. He like it, let's do it, you know. So I went over there, I went to his yard and we link him and we sit down and we write it, rearrange some things and we sat down and wrote it together and voice it recorded. You know, it's a, it's a good link up. Maccabee is a, it's a lyricist, it's proper lyricist. Yes, high, he's on a high level from from when you were li listening to What's the Sound and all these things and Maccabee is a proper lyricist and even up to his day he's still going to sing. So it's a, it's a good combination, you know, like. You know, you know, you know what's really good for me though, and mm. what I admire as well is the professionalism of yeah. Maka. Still, you know, <clears throat> because it's Maka B, yeah? Yeah, 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 and um, and so he's humble enough mm. to work with the eye. You know what I mean? Mm. I, I, and that, but he's also professional enough to to make sure you raise your game. Yeah, yeah. And he cares about the thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Because you can work with some people, you know, some especially people. artists that's bigger than you. Yeah, you know? and just gear any old. And they just gear like, any yeah, old yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause they don't business, you understand what I mean? But Michael's like, no man, I'll give you a strength. Yeah. And when he said he was going to give me a strength, he meant that, you know. Mm -hmm. So even after, I'll tell you something, even after we voice it, we voice it by him. Um, yeah, 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 we like it, blah, 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 come away. Well, I don't know, two days later, maybe the day later, where my phone rings, Michael, yes, King. So yeah, Sola, you know something? I said, yeah. He said, you know the fast style? I said, yeah. He said, we feel like you could have do that better, you know. Mm. Which, 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 I said for which, real. He said, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." He said, "Listening it now, you know." And I feel like I feel like you could have do it better. I feel like your part could have be a bit stronger still, you know. Mm -hmm. So I better you come back and do that. He's like, "I hope you don't mind." I said, "I hope I don't mind." I Z said, "Brother, things like this is good, you know." Because <laughs> I said, "I hope I don't yeah, mind." Yeah. I said, "Mark, I give thanks that you, you have that that you have that 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 professionalism there. Yeah, you, you, that you're gonna you, you call me that. and tell me come back and do this mm -hmm. thing better than mm -hmm. that." I said, "What do you mean? Yeah. When?" when? Mm. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I'm your forward, you know what I mean? So yeah, you know when you see, when you have somebody like that yeah, who, who's yeah. ready to egg you on a, and take you up to a, another level uh, and nah, teach you certain things as well, you know what I mean? Good, yeah, good, yeah, it was a great experience. Really we got Maccabee, man. Kind of, Every time. Yeah, general, man. Yeah, yeah, Every yeah. Time. yeah. Entertainment alongside education and that we bring to the nation. Now Maccabee and Solar Mountain in a combination bringing information for generation after generation. What we say? We're there for a mission, entertainment is the prize. Exposing all their behaviors, lies, lies. A lyrical assault upon injustice in this time. Dropping bars of knowledge on a baseline. Entertainment is the key. Positive message to the people with lyrics and melody. Entertainment is the key. Listen, Solar Bantan. And this is Maccabee. Yeah. Tell them Maccabee. Education in a entertaining manner uh -huh. I and I apply the flag and I sum the banner We no business about the glitz and the glamour no, sir. We Rastafari yeah. I give the ancestors the honor A lyrical education with the music and the grammar No slackness and no badness No boasting of no armor In a Babylon works we throw the spanner Burn out the original scammer Edutainment is the key Positive message to the people with lyrics and melody Edutainment is the key Open up your mind to all them fast philosophy So yeah, that, that day was a, was a great experience for Okay, that. The, edutainment, go check it out, yeah, but And it's still, that's still out on the back Yeah, 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 yeah that's Digital nice. downloads that's everywhere, nice. you know what I mean? Nice. Check it out, check it out Okay, um, the other day you sent, you, sent me, you sent me a thing the other day And so yo, Minty, pre this I'm a super, I'm a listener, you know what? I'd get in the daytime, but I said, sometime I like to wait till I reach my yard and play it good so I can hear the fullness of it. Yes, I'm listening and I said, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, you know I'm, I'm, I'm like them style, you yes, know, sir. it's yeah. like an 80s feel and, and you know, it's an, a nice dance hall style, you know. Yes, sir. So I um, say, okay, it's called Old Ragamuffin. And, um, but, and that's the title of the, the new album. Yeah, yeah that's, the title, that's the title track of the new album. Okay, still, okay, so, okay. so the Maccabee is on the album as well. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. is on the album. Yeah, that's the, um, that's the title track. And that's the, the, 
for that particular track, the old Raga Muffin, that's mm. what I was looking for really, is that kind of 80s Raga style. Remember that Raga style yeah, when he was having the 80s yeah. there, that kind because of thing? Because the old really Raga Muffin is like, like, boy, you're still doing your thing, but you're just gonna do it raga style. Yes, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you might go around the corner and do it a bit lay lay, but try, yeah, yeah, it's raga style. Yeah, man, you still get the thing done. And you done. get it done, you get the thing done, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, and that's, yeah, that yeah, was the yeah, vibe yeah. still. That's, that's okay, the thing. Nice, nice, yeah. nice. So, on the album, how much, how much tracks have been made on 12 that? tracks on the album. 12 tracks on the album. Yeah. Album, Oh, and that's us reality shock, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So on this album, it's the first time. Like I said to you before, there was other producers on the other albums. This album here it's is solely it's, reality it's shock. Me and Chris came in the studio. Nice, solely nice. reality mm. shock productions, you know. And we sat down. We said, "Yeah, we're gonna make an album." Yeah. And we made an album, brand new, like all, all, all brand new tracks. You know mm. what I mean? So yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, right. so um, when the when, when that comes out, that's gonna be everywhere. That's gonna be yeah, that will be on on every on all formats on mm. on all formats. You know what I mean? Okay, even even vinyl as well. Yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna do vinyl. It won't be it won't be out on vinyl straight away, mm. but we're gonna do vinyl later on down the line. Cause yeah. vinyl's a real collector's thing, so I wanna yeah, so I wanna put it I wanna mm. put it out digitally, CD uh, and them thing there, then and see what tracks people are really requesting, and then we're probably gonna with the vinyl with some dub mixes of those tracks as yeah, well, you know okay, what I mean? Okay, yeah, we want to yeah. put that out first and just get some feel, because we wouldn't get too short. Get a sure. feel for it first. Yeah, because yeah, it won't yeah. be the whole 12, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, yeah. It'll probably be six with six dubs or something mm. like that, you mm. know what I mean? So, yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, do I go off in? Make sure you get it, when it, when it, when it. Yeah, when, when it comes out, it's coming out soon. Yeah, 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 yeah. very soon. Any, any day now, any yeah, day yeah, now, yeah, any yeah. day now. 2019, we're there, we're there, we're there. I'm a fuck boss this time, man. Oh, rag a muffin. I'm a winner too. I, I, I'm Samana. Oh, rag a muffin. Now we don't say the trend. I'm a fuck boss this time. I'm a homie step, homie stride. I'm a movies like me a glide. I'm a dance. I think of Michael Jackson. I'm a boss. I'm a moon slide. So I'm cool like the birds. I'm a swang like the trees. And I see men some trees. No, me want to blow this smoke straight from the east to the west. tracks that we're gonna release as singles as well and and, and have visuals for them as well mm, nice, nice. Moving on, yeah. but nowadays you, you kind of need the visuals to, to help um move the tune forward you know? it, 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 like, we're, we're, this this media world nowadays everything is visually it's, it's, it's that age it's that age mm, still mm. Where, where, where you need to do that but at, at the same time i, I love doing videos because mm, mm. it, it, it brings it brings a, it gives the track another life yeah, 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 yeah. And you can get to explain more about what the track is about with the video as well. Because you know? I, like, my whole idea of, of a video, because you know sometimes people might not understand the lyrics of, 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 of the tune, but when they see the video and the video is is is, is explaining how the lyrics and, and everything in the yes, video, so they, they get more understanding of, of yes, the tune. definitely, you know? definitely. Mm. So, so that's why I love doing it. I know it's sort of acting anyway. But that's why, um, yeah, I, I like doing um, um, visual videos for the song, man. Mm. Really, so, yeah, there'll be uh, a few more videos coming out with tracks of the LP still, you know. Okay. I have a combination on there with Early 16. Mm -hmm. I'll do a video for, for that one there still, you know what I mean? Okay, okay. <laughs> so, how many, how many collaborations on there then? So, there's uh, the Maccabee mm. Entertainment. There's a song called Universal Language uh, with Early 16. There's a song called Wickedness Trending. That's with Mikey General. And, um, oh, Mikey General, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, in Jamaica yeah. the other day and um, okay. I pulled up to the dub club. Yes, sir. And um, he pulled up just in front of me. Okay. And I'm going to walk out and I said, oh, Mikey, that? I said, Mikey, what? Well, I said, Minty, are you that? <laughs> yeah, 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 Jackson, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah nice bear, nice oh, bear. Yeah, man. I know yeah. a lovely brother, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Mikey, he, he's, he's one in a million still, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? I'm a wretched lad. 
Okay. So yeah, and then there's, and there's a, another track on there with um with a, a female artist called Sabrina Bell. I've done some recordings with her before as well. You know, she's she's from Reading. Like okay. a really soulful. She's a soul singer, really. You yeah. know, her style is more more soul. You know what I mean? But every now and then, I can I convince her. Yeah, I, I say, yo, oh, Sabrina. Jump on this rhythm, yeah. Versus, versus, <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's yeah, very yeah. versatile, okay. and I just love her voice. Though, yeah, you know? yeah. So okay. when I wrote that song there, mm. I couldn't hear any other voice. I'm like, yeah, oh, it's, it's, that's Sabrina, you know what mm. I mean? So okay. she's on there as well. So I give thanks for that as well. And and, and, and all your lyrics, you, you write all of your yes, lyrics, yeah. yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. yes, nice, sir. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, I got my thing. You need, you need, you need it. <laughs> Anything else happening for yourself? Cause I know you, you're traveling all the while, man. But it's non-stop, you know. I mean, is that the jazz cafe the other day with um Johnny Osborne? With Johnny Osborne. How, yeah. how was that? Oh, yeah, that was a great show. Yeah. Great okay, show. Okay, nice yeah. and busy, you know. Mm. Yeah, it's a lovely show for me to get to support in Johnny Osborne. Yeah, well. yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I met him a few times, but to be supporting him was really good. You know what I mean? Oh, good, good look, good look, man. Yeah, man. Mm. So I give thanks, and I got to sing some of the new the new stuff as well. Yeah. At the show as well, so that was nice to get him a run out. I met people hear them as well. You know yeah, what I mean? yeah. Okay. And his performance is just Johnny in it. Yeah, Johnny is he's just unnatural. Yeah, it's Johnny. Isn't it? It's just you know you can't say nothing more yeah, than the man. You know, from crazy. day one, yeah. from 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 the sixties until now, every song you ever hear, Johnny just hits it. Yeah, it's never weak. No, it's, it's singing just like the record. It's never you, weak. You, and and you, when you see him yeah. live, it's exactly the same as the record. Mm. Exactly the same. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. You know, some man you hear them live. I'm me myself. You know, me. You don't. You can hear it. It's like a little change. Yeah, but you see, Johnny, his voice is strong and powerful. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Every time he said that, there's only there's not many singers who's like that. To be fair, you know, mm, mm. but I put Johnny in that category. I put Freddie McGregor in that character in that category too. Mm, you know mm, what I mean? Mm. Now for me, any time the man that open their voice, yeah, yeah. it just sound like them. It never sound weak. It never sound yeah, like nothing else. It just strong, sound like they're strong and just yeah. there. You know, so okay, his performance okay. was amazing. You know what I mean? All right. So what, what else? Else? Anything else coming up? Anything in the pipeline or just concentrate more? It's on just gonna. It's mainly gonna be concentrating on on the um on promote promoting this album and the whole mm. random up and really so. Got loads of launch parties up and down, up and down the country and over Europe still. Mm. And then I'm um, gonna go to Australia and New Zealand mm -hmm. in March. Okay. okay. Gonna tour it out there in March still. Yeah. Um, of next year, that's 2020. Yeah, true. Okay, and also, nice. yeah, looking to do um, looking to do Asia as well at some point. I wanted to try and do it in the same trip as Australia and New Zealand, mm. but that's not gonna happen now. So later on in the year, so mm. Australia will be early 2020. Then later on in the year we're gonna go and do do some China and Vietnam nice, and Thailand nice. and then places still, you know what I mean? But, and um, yeah, I, I need to get a Mexico in somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> get as much places as you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I ain't been, I haven't been back to Mexico for a while, so oh, okay, and they're okay. crying, they're crying. So mm, mm, mm. Yeah, so it's really mainly gonna be just about pushing that album there yeah. so I can see that's gonna Keep you busy keep for, you keep you busy for a good while, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a, a good oh, year okay. or two that should keep you busy, really. Yeah. You know uh, I mean? Nice, nice, nice. I nice. recorded a few other singles here mm. and there, you know what I mean, which will be out in due time still, but mainly just pushing the album. Right now. All right, nice, nice, nice. So, um, um, uh, what am I saying? I'm going to be editing this, is anyway. it? <laughs> um, all right, for any ice and whatever out there you know you know just a little words of wisdom of the encouragement to anybody who's getting into the game because you know some some people getting it then what i've noticed recently because i remember we're in that age where everybody got student in the yard and, and everybody's got laptop and, and and logics and pro tools and so forth but there's, there's very few people doing it for the for the love of it. Everyone is like saying, yeah, yeah, I can make some money, make some money. But um, it's not all about that. You have to have the love for the music. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just <clears throat> yeah, little words of encouragement for anybody getting into the business. You know what I mean? Um, first of all, first and foremost, you know, don't get into it for the money because mm. you get into it for the wrong reasons. You know, make sure it's a love first. You know. It's gonna take a while for the money to come. See, the problem with us, you know, in society nowadays, you know, is um, we've been trained and programmed on everything coming like this. Mm. Everybody thinks it's an X factor, quick thing. You know what I mean? You turn up, you do an audition, and rah, you get the golden buzzer or whatever like that. You mm. understand what I mean? Everybody wants everything now, and and the problem with getting it so quick is you haven't learned the thing. 
You know, there's a uh, you know I, I think you can bust too quick. Mm. You know, and next thing you know, you're on stage at a massive festival or whatever like that, and you haven't got the training for that. Yeah. And you're gonna flop. You're gonna pop down because you you haven't gone through that. You know what I mean? You know, it, you know, you might well have a hit song on it and it works out for you and that's great. But try, learn, learn your trade. Learn, learn the trade. You know, what I'm so saying? don't worry. It's, it's the longevity. Of yeah, yeah. So don't worry about taking yeah. your time and getting there because as you're taking the time, you're learning. Mm -hmm. All these years I've been doing the sound system thing, even though that's not wasn't the aim to be that artist. Everything I learned through that. It's helping me now. Yeah, it's, a, it's a learning process. So yes, I, I, and, and so it doesn't phase me now. I could get on stage now and in front of X amount of people at a festival or whatever like that, and the microphone's not working properly. Mm -hmm. The microphone's chipping out or it's feeling back or something like that. It don't phase me because I've mm -hmm. been through all of that already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas I've seen some people who's come up too quick and that phased them. Mm -hmm. And they don't know what to do, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And, and it looks bad on them, you know what I mean? So. Learn, learn your thing. Don't, don't, don't worry about taking the time. Learn your thing and leave your house mm. as a producer. Leave your house. Because the problem is, like you said, everyone can do it at home on mm. a laptop, you know. Mm -hmm. and, so, and, and, and so what I find you hear now is you hear a lot of tunes that are nice, but they could have been great. Yeah. But it's only the one set of ears listening to yeah, it. Yeah, it needs more ears. It needs more ears listening yeah. to it. And you need to get yourself out. Mm -hmm. uh, and away from the computer, you need to get out there. Listen, go to some shows, listen to music, and see how the people are reacting to tunes and what they like, mm -hmm. and and these things. You know what I mean? And hear the sounds. You know what I mean? And come back. And, and um, <laughs> I have a lot of advice still. The other thing I would say is, you know, at the beginning, like I said, don't look for the money, you know. Mm -hmm. So give, don't be frightened to give your thing away for free. Mm -hmm. No, okay. Yeah, sometimes it takes some take people. Long. Yeah. yeah, some cause, cause sometimes you, you, you can say it. like, "Now nah, I want money. I want you. You have to pay me for this." But if nobody don't know you, mm. nobody don't want to buy it. Yeah, yeah. So you know, don't don't feel no way at the beginning to tell a man a whole list because mm -hmm. it's far better you got it and you hear it and you hear of me mm. and you play in it and someone else hears of me. You know what I mean? I, I'll be completely honest with you. I think for maybe the first year, year and a half when mm. I first started performing. Um, I was going out with another artist, I was going out with Deadly Hunter, he'd take me there, I was just going out to his backing singer and he let me do a couple, of, do a lot, a couple of tuning that, you know, mm. I never got no money for them tuning. Mm. Like, they, they, the people then would pay for my transport, i pay for my hotel or rent and and I was grateful for that. But again, <coughs> two I, things I've done that let me, give me experience, experience and it make people yeah. hear my name. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, we all yeah, have to do yeah, this. So you have to, you have to mm. invest. It's an investment. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So just think invest about your invest, your, your invest your time. Self. Yeah, yeah. Just the, the time that you're giving for free, you're investing in your own self, mm. and it will pay dividends because now everybody know your name, mm, mm. and then you're gonna get booking. Mm. You know, you know what I mean? So and and if I didn't do it at the beginning, who's to say I'll be getting bookings now? Because people yeah, still nah, might know, know me. You know yeah. what I mean? So don't be frightened to give your things away mm. for free at the beginning. You know what I mean? Don't be frightened to do that. And you don't even the have words of wisdom. From the totally yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? We we could we could go on for for, for ages <laughs> about this thing because there's so much to talk about. You know it's what I like, mean? Yeah. Mm. Okay. But um, now nah, man, it's good for liquor reasoning and so forth, yes, man. Right, but yes, all right. the muffin. Make sure you get grab grab yourself a copy because it's needed in your collection. Yeah. <laughs> Social media comes directly to me, so you can catch me on Instagram, Solar Banton Official. You can catch me on Facebook. I don't do Twitter. Mm. I ain't got time for them things there, really. You know what I mean? I I, I struggle keeping up with 
Facebook yeah. and, and, and I ain't got time to be living my life and, and Twitter is a nonsense. I don't mm. do Twitter but um, Instagram, Facebook that comes to me or, and for all information really you can just go to the website solarbanton.com you know mm. and, and, and all anything you want to buy latest shows and, and, and things working out is all there at solarbanton.com Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. All right, well, so though, it's a wrap, but um, give thanks. It's been nice for yeah. nice for the reason. Yes, sir. And Love good luck in the future and the album and everything, you know what I mean? And just keep it going, keep it going, brother. Yes, yeah, brother, yeah, man. Enough love. Big up Minty as well, you know. Years, you know. As I said, I've <laughs> known this brother for so long. He's <laughs> said area, Shepherd's Bush, <laughs> West London. And um, but just now we're getting to the reasoning, so. Nothing before it's time, you yes, know the way that. Yes, sir. But um, it's been nice. But um, we're out to the next time. In conversation. We're out. Ciao. Bless you, guys.